Right. Hi, welcome to our in the Box on the Seven Valley Railway. Um, this is um, this is a, a thirty lever frame that used originally to be in Kidderminster um, Station Box, um, and then was moved here in preservation time. Uh, the actual structure of the box came from Yorton. It's, it's a northwestern box off the route from um, Shrewsbury to to, um, to Crewe. Um, so this is not the original box for this for this um, for this station. Um, has been here since preservation since, since we opened down here in 1974. So we work at we work at electric key token to Beauty North in that direction, and we work at EKT to Highly in that direction. But sometimes when the traffic is quiet, we can switch this box out and work a long section between Beauty North and Highly, and then this box just becomes redundantly switched out, and you have a lever for doing that. Number 12 here. So you can see that um, this is the lever frame. We have space for 30 levers. Um, and um, there are some gaps and there are some spares, the white one here. But most of the leaders you can see do, do something important. Uh, the red ones are for signals, um, the black ones are for points, and the blue ones are for locking the points to make sure they can't move under a train as it approaches. Oh, and the yellow ones are the distance signals, the signals that give an advance warning to the driver a long way out from the station as they're approaching. Um, so on the block shelf here, you can see the, the bells, which we use to communicate to the two signal boxes either side of this one, to North and to, and to Highly. Um, these instruments repeat the, the lamp indications in the signals. So at night time when the lights are lit in the signals, we can tell if the lamp goes out, because obviously it's clear that's important to know about. Um, this one here repeats the indication of a signal that I can't see. There's a signal right down the corner, number six, that is way out of my sight. But I need to be sure that when I pull the lever, it works properly. So therefore, this instrument here repeats the indication. Um, and this instrument here is an, um, an indicator, is a repeater for the track circuit, uh, which is on the approach to the um, down home signal over there. These are the EKT machines, uh, electric key token machines. Um, these date right back to the turn of the last century. Um, and we're pretty standard on the main line, and still exist in some places even now. Uh, but are obviously increasingly rare. Um, and so basically, the, the key token in the machine is the authority that we give to the driver. On a single line section of the railway, what happened clearly, you need to be sure that you can't have a head on crash. And there are various ways of achieving that. But in the olden days, the drivers were given a physical authority, um, which in this case is an electric key token. There are other ways of doing it as well. And at each end of the signal line section, the signalman has an instrument for that particular section into which are locked lots of key tokens. And only one key token can be out of the machine at any time from either end. So once I've taken one key token out of here, no more can be taken out. So I give that to the driver, the driver knows it's safe to proceed with the signal line section. When he gets to the other end of the section, gives the signalman there, puts it in his machine at his end, and then we know it's all good to go again. Uh, and if I try and take one out myself now, without authority and the correct permissions, I can't do it. If I try and put it into the lock, and take it out now, it won't come out the lock. Because in order to get it out, not only must there be no tokens out of the machine already, but also I need the permission of the signal at the other end of the section to do that. And we achieved that by a system of bell code communication using the plunger on the block belt here. So I hope you enjoyed this brief visit to our signal box on the 7 Railway. Enjoy!
box out of circuit, what you do is that you set the road for the through route through the up and down lane, and then you send the irrelevant bell, bell uh, signal, which is 557, to both boxes at the same time, highly and um, group view to north. Then when they respond, there's a cacophony of bells for a bit, then they both hold down. That releases the switching out lever, which comes back to position three, which means you can then clear the signals in both directions for the up and down at the same time through, through the one main running road. And then when you've done that, you pull the lever 12 back into position four, notch four, job done.